The misconception about Renton is that because we're in the suburbs and there's not much to do. However, today I'm disproving that myth with 12 things to do in Renton, Washington. Let's get into it. Hello, my name is Vaina Jerebek. I'm a real estate agent here in the greater Seattle area. Thanks so much for tuning into my channel where we talk about all things living in Washington, moving to Seattle, talking about the great things our state has to offer. Today, we're talking about 12 fun things to do in Renton, Washington. So right into it, number one, my favorite thing to do here in Renton is go down to the water. So Renton is located right on Lake Washington, which is the lake that separates the east side from Seattle, one of the most highly desired neighborhoods in here in Washington. So when you're in Renton and you go down to the lakefront, you can see across the Mercer Island and some peekaboo views of city of Bellevue, and you see all the beautiful waterfront homes. We have lots of beach parks in Renton and trails right on the water. Great way to pass time and get some exercise. Number two, like I just mentioned, we have beach parks. So Kennedale Beach Park, Heritage Park, Jean Coulomb Park. We have a lot of great parks in each neighborhood in Renton. You know, playgrounds for the kids, tennis court, volleyball, as much beach as Washington can get, and trails. So lots of outdoor activities to do when it's not raining, which I would honestly say is a good 40% of the year. You could go out and go to a park and have fun and you won't get rained out. So lots of outdoor activities on that front. Number three, go check out the Renton Landing. So Renton Landing is located right off exit five on 405, five minutes away from Kennedale, five minutes away from downtown Renton, five minutes away from Liberty Ridge. It's next to the Bowling Plant. It's on Lake Washington. Washington, ton of great restaurants. We have Thai food, Korean food, Chinese food, American food, pizza joints. You can spend a good chunk of the day at the landing. Number four, downtown Renton. So kind of similarly to the landing, downtown Renton is actually older. It's historic Renton. So we have lots of antique shops, some little cafes and bakeries. There's a lot to explore in downtown Renton. And then again, there's a couple parks. There's a library, lots to explore in downtown Renton. Number five, you can do water sports. There's a couple spots here where you can rent kayaks. You can grab a boat, get some jet skis on the water. Summertime, everyone's out on boats and jet skis. We have a sailboat club. Lake Washington is safe to swim in so you can get out and have a good time on the water. Number six, Renton History Museum. I was never a history person growing up in school. I think because they force you to learn about it, but but I actually really like going to museums now. And Renton used to be a coal town, so Renton History Museum has a lot about the miners and occasional demonstrations that kind of show what life was like back in the day here in Renton. It's also free on the first Thursday of every month, so if you have nothing to do, you have no excuse. It's free. <laughs> you might as well check it out. Number seven, so Renton has two really popular trails where people really go hiking trails. So there's May Creek Trail and there's the Newcastle Highlands Park. May Creek is very flat, it's a little shorter. It's a cute place to take your dog or your kids. Well, and then Newcastle is a longer one, more nature-y I would say, but it's a fun way to get out into nature and still be close to home. Number eight activity that Renton is known for, so is Washington or PNW in general. We have lots of biking. So we have a dedicated biking path all the way through to Bellevue and up north. So, so you can go from Renton to Bellevue or Renton to Kent. Good 15, 20, 30 mile bike ride. Great way to spend time outdoors. Number nine thing you can do in Renton is the Henry Moses Aquatic Center. Really cool little water park. They have water slides and a lazy river and a kiddie pool. Highly recommend. It's a great place to hang out and spend a really sunny day. It does get booked quickly though, so make sure you reserve your tickets online. Number 10, you can participate in community events. So pretty often City of Renton will put on festivals or farm days. A lot of great opportunities to participate, volunteer, or just bring the family and enjoy the fun. You can just Google City of Renton events to see what's going on. Number 11 thing to do in Renton, you can play golf. So if you're a golfer, Maplewood Golf Course is very popular. Lots of members, you can get out, play golf, have a good time. Every once in a while there's a tournament. Even City of Renton puts on some tournaments. They also have a driving range and other couple activities. And our final activity to do in Renton is a seaplane tour. So currently costs about $120 per adult, but you can get a narrated seaplane tour that takes off from Lake Washington and goes around the area, get a little tour of Lake Washington. Check it out online, it'd be a great thing to do to explore the area. So those are our 12 things to do in Renton. I hope this video helped. Thanks so much for watching this video. If you have any questions about moving to Washington, you know where to find me. Links are all below and I'll see you in the next video.